Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two new to us brownies. Uh, these are fully baked brownies from the Better Together Bake Shop in Philly, Pennsylvania. Uh, I have the sea salt and caramel brownies. And I have peanut butter chocolate brownie. These were $5.49 a box at Kroger, so not cheap at all for five individually wrapped brownies. Let's see how small they are, or how big they are. Ah, okay. These, that's the size you get. That's the size brownie you get. And this is the sea salt. Well, I'll tell you more about them. Um, you can wait to enjoy these. These are frozen. They're fr they're in the frozen department, and there are two other kinds that I know of that they make. They make like a cookies and cream, and then they make like a maybe a fudge brownie or something. But they didn't have those yet at our Kroger. If they get them in, if we like these, then we might try them. Well, okay. mine. It's only 200 calories for that. Okay, mine, the sea salt caramel is 170 calories. Yeah, mine's 200. Oh, okay. okay, so you microwave them for 10 to 15 seconds. Uh, that's each, right? So each. I'll probably put 15 since there's 200. Okay, so there are different ways to enjoy these. You can pop them in the microwave for 10 to 15 seconds. That's what we're doing, of course. Or you can put them in the oven at 300 degrees for five minutes. Or it says you can eat them frozen, which I can't even imagine, but you can, you can eat them frozen, or you can thaw them on the countertop for half an hour. So just like those little um, sandwich things, the peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, the Uncrustables, uh, you leave those out for half an hour, you would leave this out for half an hour. It says, we had a simple idea, pick better ingredients and pair them together to elevate brownies to new levels of deliciousness. We hope you'll see why we believe some things are simply better together. So you get five, like I said, and it says 100% all natural indulgence. So this one is made with sugar, caramel, and bittersweet chocolate and with other things. This one is gonna be made with sugar, salted butter, bittersweet chocolate and all natural peanut butter is what this one says. So did you keep them? Just peanut butter. That's peanut butter, um, okay. It took about 20 seconds total because I put it in for 15, they were still cold. Right. So I put them in for another five. So it okay. took 20 seconds all yeah. So we'll try the sea salt caramel first. It is 170 calories. Oops, it's bald. It's hard to tell. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Oh. Not bad. Mm. Um, they're not very sweet. No. And they kind of have a graininess to them. But not bad. I it's think more it, of a darker chocolate brown. Mm -hmm. Well, it's bittersweet. I like it. I think it. I, I thought it tasted good. I don't. I didn't taste any sea salt at all. No. I didn't no. really get caramel. And I really didn't taste. <laughs> No, it's really just dark chocolate. Yeah, to me it just tasted like a regular brownie. Like if you if you bake a box of brownies, except it's not as sweet as a regular yeah, box of brownies. Yeah, exactly. Devil. But I didn't taste any sea salt or caramel. No, which is sad. Okay, now I'm hoping to get some peanut butter. This has a little lime through it. Okay, so that has to be the peanut butter. I would hope so. It smells like peanut like butter. Mm. You get a peanut butter. Yes, I it, don't like the flavor of that peanut butter. It's a <clears throat> yeah. It's all natural peanut butter. No, I actually like it. I like the flavor of that peanut butter. Mm. That's it has a like funky, it. chunky kind of flavor mm. to me. No, I like that. I like that a lot. That's it. I mean, this goes in awful. It kind of tastes like what wet dog food smells like. Oh, Kevin. I just don't like it. That's the, that's the, I mean, I could see where you would like it because mm -hmm. you're not, you don't eat regular peanut butter either. I don't, yeah, I never eat so regular peanut butter. So any kind of peanut butter you can get, you'll like. Um, <laughs> it's not bad, it just, it's not, I think it's the sweetness is what I'm missing. This one doesn't have the really a sweetness to it either. It's I, better. Yeah. It's better than the first one, but there's still not 
nice sweetness there. Right, no, it's not. It's it's a bitter sweet chocolate. Um, I like both of them. There's nothing wrong with this one. It's just that it, it says sea salt caramel and I didn't get it. No. Um, You'd be better off getting a little daddy brownie. Uh, <laughs> but the, the peanut butter, I really like. I like the peanut butter. I like the flavor of the peanut butter. Hmm. Not for me. Either one of these I would get. I would I would much rather get just a little little Debbie or something like that brownie. Even mm -hmm. though I wouldn't eat those either, but that, I would rather have those than these. There won't be a picture at the end. Because I just ate that. Well they look just like they pretty much look like the picture on the box. I mean not exactly. They really do. It's pretty close. Uh but yeah, even after eating finishing off that I I swear I got the the slightest little hint of caramel in that last bite. I mean the slightest hint of caramel, but it wasn't throughout, so I can't say that it tasted like it said it was. Right. But I think they're expensive. I think five forty nine. You get five in here. The You're over paying a over piece. a dollar a piece for these little bitty squares. I think that's too expensive. Yeah. So like even said, though I like the peanut butter one, I, I won't buy the peanut butter again because it's just too expensive. Yeah. Yeah, I would. So, but now I would be willing after eating these. I would be willing if we can find the other two. I would definitely give them a try because they have cookies and cream, and I want to say just a regular fudge brownie, which I can't <laughs> imagine it tasted much different than that. But um, if I find those in Kroger, I would be willing to try those because to me, I thought these were good enough. But now they are too expensive. And it does say they're all natural, so I'm willing to try them for you. But I won't buy them again for me just for the pleasure of it because it's too much. Yeah. If that makes sense to you. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.